Okay, good morning. Welcome to Math Problems Number 108. Math Problems Number 108. So we've been working a little bit on algebraic expressions this week, but I've been having to go to work a lot. So yeah. um, early, like I do today. So we haven't even talked about this kind of stuff yet. So we're just going to try to do, to go ahead. So what do you think you'd like to do first to get started on something like this? Let's, we could try the order of operations. Mm -hmm. All right, order of operations. What does order of operations say? So we'll find the stuff in the parentheses first. Okay. Anything to be simplified in the parentheses? Well, there's the x's, so we can't really simplify anything. No, it's a good good idea to do inside the parentheses first, but in this case, they're already all simplified. Yeah. Right. So what, what do you want to try next? Well, order of operations says. Adams, add and subtract from left to right outside the parentheses. Yeah. Then, uh, well, but there's three times this plus two times that. Yeah, so what do you think three times this means? Maybe, I, maybe it means, I, th I think it means three times whatever this is plus two times whatever that is. Yeah, so what is three times this? I think it's... 3x minus 12. Very good. 3x minus 12. And, and two we have to figure out two times of that. That's okay. Don't forget this little mark on the board right it's here. Plus. Okay. So plus. Let's not, let's not, don't forget those pluses and minuses. So there's, it's, now it's 2 times 2 minus 4x. 2 minus 4x. Very good. So you were right to think to simplify inside the parentheses first, but yeah. there was nothing more to simplify. And then we can just multiply it out. Yeah. And 3 times this is 3x minus 12. 2 times that is 2, 2 times 1, mm -hmm. minus 4x. Okay, awesome. So now we have, all we have to do is, is add this. Okay, how will we do that? Well, we could add the numbers and non-numbers. Okay. So this is minus 12 plus positive 2. That's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna be 10. So, because that's, that's minus, that's, that's, a, that's gonna be minus 10. Minus 10, okay. Minus 12 plus 2 is? Minus 10. Okay, minus 10. All right. And this is 3x minus 4x, that's minus 1, it's, mi it's minus, it's minus 1x. Okay, and most of the time we don't write the 1s with the, uh, when it's just an x, we'll just write that as minus x. Yep. So we get minus 10 minus x. Hmm. Right? Now how can we check if this might be right? We could make x be something. Okay, what do you want to make x be? Let's make x be... Five. Okay. If x is five, what's this? It's minus ten minus five. That's gonna be minus minus fifteen. Minus fifteen. Okay. Good job. Minus fifteen. Now let's do ooh 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 this one when x is five. Okay. So we have three times what? This is three times ten minus ten. It's ten. Uh, it's five minus four. Which is. One. So we get three times one. And plus two times um, one minus ten. It's one minus ten, so that's it's minus nine. Okay. Three times one plus two times minus nine. Okay. Yep. So that's it's just gonna be three. And I think that's going to be minus, eight, it's minus 18. Okay, 3 plus minus 18. Mm -hmm. Don't forget the plus. Yep. That's important. 3 plus minus 18. What's that? It's, it's going to be minus 15 like we got. Hey! Oops, I forgot. I forgot the 1. 3 plus... Minus 18 is minus 15. Look just like we got up there. Yeah, so hey, I think this is probably right. Yeah. Cool, right? Yeah. So that's a pretty pretty complicated algebraic expression, right? Yeah. And 
And we, it just all got down to minus 15. Oh, it just got down to minus, well, when x was 5, it got down yeah. to minus 15. Okay, hey, good job. Now we have a few problems like that for homework today, okay? Yes. Alrighty, good job, huh?